This tutorial is to show you how to create a flash video for your website using ProShow Producer. All right. Uh, now this, this uh, as you can see, uh, we already have a, a project that is is been made that is already on the timeline. All right. Uh, some of you, if you don't know what a flash video is. For instance, a lot of the advertisement that comes out on the website, when you're on the website, they're flash, flash videos, advertisements. You know, they're video that is compressed at a very uh, smaller size and video files. Uh, a lot of them have audio and test along with the video and mostly used for advertisement. But if it is something, uh, it plays constantly and continuously. For instance, depending on how you you place them on, on your website or, or any website that is advertising it for you, uh, but mostly flash video is used on a website like on your website uh, without an audio, and it's just play constantly and continuously on your site, uh, uh, mostly to advertise uh, uh, any kind of product or a, a movie or stuff like that. So basically, we're just gonna I'm gonna run you through how to how to uh, create a flash video right now we have uh, too many I'm gonna delete some of these just to cut our time short by clicking uh, right click uh, there's no delete we're just gonna go ahead delete select slide and I'm gonna delete this also that's it remove delete letter slide uh, let me see what is I don't know want I think that is pretty cool this I'm gonna remove this all right now as you can see you're gonna you, you know you have three different buttons here build uh, design if you've been watching a lot of my uh, previous uh, tutorial, we've been working in the design uh, uh, phase, and now we're gonna go to publish. All right, and at publish, you want to look for uh, something Adobe Adobe Flash. Once you found it, you want to click click on create all right and now you have video format mpeg4 require flash 9 and then uh, and you can click it has a download arrow click on it you can also create it in flv file format it doesn't matter but i'm gonna stick with mpeg4 because what that does it it gives you it allow you to be able to see the video when it is created on like flv you know so when i say see it i mean like uh, you can preview it with a uh, window media player and many other uh, player to preview it on like flash uh, flv uh, but in that case just go to the next one video for three megabyte three i uh, am broadband yeah five if you're using a high speed internet uh, you can create at five but i'm gonna discourage you from doing that just go with three or 1.5 but the thing is the higher it is the better the quality of the flash that you're gonna have so we're gonna go down to the next second best quality and you can adjust the size of the resolution here and the frame rate is here uh loop show always check uh just read down here and see which one apply to you and once you finish doing that just uh one other thing keep in mind this is an, an option button yeah you want to go to menu menu all right if you want a template a team for your show you're gonna select a team and this is what it's gonna look like all right i put other themes here let's say we want this to be Pro show. Uh, 
we're just gonna name it after you your show you know and right here it says pro show slide slide show all right normally i don't use templates for my show i seriously don't because the good thing for not okay when you don't use templates your show automatically just play the video straight all right when you use template it still play but when it's finished playing it's come back to the template and it show everything it stays there for like few seconds then it it plays all over again uh but the choice is yours of course so uh for your own purpose or for the purpose of this class we're gonna let's see if you skip temp template is gonna say no menu all right so let's take with no menu go to show and right here it says include intro show if you include this this is gonna record at the beginning of your video you don't want that so uncheck this all right uh, and you go to option which is where we made all the uh, editing from adjustment so just go and create, click on create and where do you want to save it we're gonna call it pro show flash did I say your show flash and we're gonna click save all right And you can see it is rendering, it's rendering pretty fast. I'm gonna pause this video and bring you in once it finished rendering. It's only 25 seconds, maybe I should let you watch it to render. Now my next tutorial is possibly is gonna be ba based on I'm gonna be going through all this different uh, stuff right here, uh, all the different publishing formats, and if you wanna create stuff depending on what kind of show, if you wanna pr create stuff for DVD, uh, for website, uh, you should uh, uh, you got to remember one thing that this pro show producer can be used to. Uh, edit both pictures and videos when I say edit uh, not real video editing but to create some kind of uh, effects you know minor effect it's really a lot of effect for pictures but it's I don't know how much of effect you can create using video uh, but this helps a lot with pictures so this is done uh, rendering the flash has been created successfully click OK Normally it automatically comes up, allow block content, and that is the flash for the website. Alright, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to exit out of that and I'm going to go to where the flash was created and we can view it from there. And here is the flash, your show. That is the flash we just created for the website. And this flash is supposed to play continuously without stopping on your website once it's uploaded. It's pretty cool, huh? You know you, you can create something like this to make your website pop you know yeah it could be at the top of the page it's it could be at the bottom of the page like on the footer uh, people just logged in there and saw this beautiful flash playing all the time you know just amazing it start all over over and over again and just keep on playing and you can create so many flash that you can load 
uh, have different flash plane every day, different days or different day of the week. You remove them, you upload a new one and remove let it stay for like a week remove it and also you can create and you can use it as advertisement for people i mean for companies and that is it and that's how you create flash i hope you do learn something from this tutorial uh, if you have any question for me do not hesitate to ask and and look out for my next tutorial on using different published formats uh, uh, well, you take care and thank you for watching. Bye-bye.